I was in the midst of what was maybe the worst breakup that I've had as an adult. I was just at my wit's end with my relationship patterns. Before I started this journey, I was in a lot of pain. I remember turning 40 and being like, I'm an accountant. What the hell am I doing with my life? And making that promise to switch careers as crazy as everyone in my life thought I was. And to shift to the thing that was like soul work versus brain work. How do we work with anyone who is feeling like a victim of anything? What can you do to feel empowered in your life? What can you do to get a foothold of power? Empowering the individual through relationship. Raise your hand if you grew a little bit. I was really struggling in all my relationships. I really believed in blaming everyone and never took any responsibility. I had to really look deep and hard at myself and I found that I was the common denominator. I was the one who had to do the work. That is growth. I would have just high-fived the hell out of her on that. I've always had a really broken relationship with my mom. I knew in my head that she did the best she could. I knew her story. I knew everything she she went through. I just could feel the shift in my entire body. Like, I will never forget that moment. And my relationship with my mom now is completely different. Like, I feel so much compassion for her. And I'm so thankful for everything she's done for me. It changed my life. I used to be a people pleaser and living through the values of other people. And I'll always worry about people judging me. But as I begin to just live authentically, you know, I become so much more grounded. I'm able to just be myself and really follow that passion and that light. Okay, this training has three parts. Self, you are going to work on yourself and you're going to look in the mirror self-reflect, which is one of the hallmarks of a secure relationship. You're also going to learn how to work with other people. Other humans are difficult. You're difficult. How do you do this self-other dance, especially in a high-stake relationship? And then finally, you are going to learn how to serve and give back and help people. And that's coaching. You're going to learn how to coach people around the self-other dynamic. Just stepping back and really listening to someone else. Like, what a concept. <laughs> like I'm 54 years old and I'm just learning that now with my kids as well. You know, they see me modeling it and I see them doing it too. And I just relate to them in a very different way. It's been huge. This class has empowered me in all of my relationships, especially with my kids. And that's definitely the most valuable to me. The work I've been doing allows me to show up for my son in such a more flexible and compassionate way. My marriage has gotten so much more solid and real. I mean, the biggest thing for me was changing my life from victim to author to become my true self. It is a tremendous amount of work to do insight and to really dig into yourself, but it's worth it. It was really fun and I just, my heart feels really full. I'm just blown away by the material and what Jason and Ellen have put together. It's just profound and I'm eternally grateful. I just wanted to say thank you. And my daughter is eight. She says thank you too, although she doesn't know it yet, but um, it's just really helped so much. So mm. I got it too. I knew I wanted to help. I just didn't realize how to do it. Through this school and through all the practice hours that we've had, we can do this. We can actually do this. We can actually go out in the world and we do have something to offer. What's up, RCT student? You have made a massive commitment to grow as a human being and to help other people grow. I am honored and humbled to serve as a coach. This is what I want to do and there's nothing else I'd rather do. And to be here, it just feels amazing. I feel like a new person. Wow, I feel so grateful. This work is so impactful and so helpful. It was a really great growing experience. It's really helped me to just be like, oh yeah, they've got this. Here's badass mofos doing the work. I'm so grateful to everybody here. Be authentic and rock it. Just do it. It's an investment in yourself. You won't regret it. Just make it happen. According to the longest study of human behavior ever done at Harvard, the quality of your life is dictated by the quality of your relationships. This course changed my life, and I would recommend it to anyone.